Psalm 7, the prayer of a wronged man. Shigoin of David, which he sang unto the Lord concerning the words of Cush the Benjamite. I was just reading this. Shigoin only occurs twice, and it's a musical notation that is somewhat mysterious, and these words are transliterated, so they are the same in Hebrew as they are in English. O Lord my God, in thee do I put my trust. Save me from all them that persecute me and deliver me, lest ye tear my soul like a lion, rending it in pieces while there is none to deliver. O Lord my God, if I have done this, if there be iniquity in my hands, if I have rewarded evil unto him that was at peace with me, yea, I have delivered him that without cause is mine enemy, let the enemy persecute my soul and take it. Yea, let him tread down my life upon the earth, and lay mine honor in the dust. Selah. Arise, O Lord, in thine anger. Lift up thyself because of the rage of mine enemies, and awake for me to the judgment that thou hast commanded. So shall the congregation of the, of the people compass thee about. For their sakes, therefore, return thou on high. The Lord shall judge the people. Judge me, O Lord, according to my righteousness and according to my integrity that is in me. O let the wickedness of the wicked come to an end, but establish the just. For the righteous God trieth the hearts and reins. My defense is of God, which saveth the upright in heart. God judgeth the righteous, and God is angry with the wicked every day. If he turn not, he will wet his sword. He hath bent his bow and made it ready. He hath also prepared for him the instruments of death. He ordaineth his arrows against the persecutors. Behold, he travaileth with iniquity, and hath conceived mischief, and brought forth falsehood. He made a pit and digged it, and is fallen into the ditch which he made. His mischief shall return upon his own head, and his violent dealing shall come down upon his own pate, his head. I will praise the Lord according to his righteousness, and will sing praise to the name of the Lord Most High. One of the things I love about Psalm 7 is Psalm 711. 711, as you know, is a store open 24 hours a day, and so 711, God is angry with the wicked every day. We have to remember this, because some people overbalance talking about the love of God, but God is also just. And so it is only those whose sins have been taken care of on the cross that there is no enmity between God and you. Actually, when I read this psalm, I have to be honest to you guys. When it says here, hey, if I have sin and, uh, you know, let this be done to me, I think, yikes. I wish I could say that about myself, but I'm a sinful man. And so we turn to 1 John 1, 9 that says, If we confess our sins, God is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from, from all unrighteousness. So a lot of this is looking to the Messiah, the one who, without sin. And we are either on the Lord's side or in enmity with him. My integrity and my righteousness, that is only Christ. Christ is our only righteousness. Another powerful psalm. And again, a warning to the wicked, those people who go and attack people and throw rocks behind a TikTok wall or otherwise. God sees all of your mischief and God will hold all people to account for every word they say or type.